crossing, how to pass the compound general entries. So today we will learn a new topic that is called as ledger. Ledger. So we will see the definition and all the features of ledger. Afterwards, now today you will see practical part of you how to maintain the ledger. So, when you start passing the journal entries, what you do here, you will write this is the format of journal date to particular LM. So now let us take one example. One four two hundred ten. Commence the business with rupees fifty thousand. So here cash amount will be debit. So ledger means what? LF column. Now we will talk about what? LF column. In the previous session I have told you that I will teach you what you learned by LF when you will come to get the next topic that is ledger. So LF means ledger for you. Ledger for you. Ledger for you. Polio means page. What is the page number in ledger? Ledger polio means. So now, if you go on writing journal entries, cash account, debit to capital account, purchase account, debit to RAM account, RAM account, debit to cash account, whatever it is, you can't get the details of a particular account under one head. So, if you want information as to how much RAM is supposed to give us, you are supposed to see the full journal and then you are supposed to turn each and every page and then note down on each date how much we have purchased from him, how much we have returned the books to him, how much payment we have made to him and how much is still pending, how much is supposed to be given to him. So it becomes a very tedious job for us to know that what is the balance that we are supposed to know details of RAM, it is very difficult only to pass the journal entries. So what you are supposed to do is, along with journal entries, you are supposed to maintain one more book called as ledger. One more book called as what? Ledger. So what we will do is, we will take one ledger book. In ledger book what happens, accounts will be there. So the ledger book will be like this. So here I am not going in detail. So now, for example, cash account has come first. So page number one. This is the page number one of my ledger book. In the ledger book, we want bonded book in which what is there? Names of various accounts are recorded. So you see your textbook. You will see the textbook. You will come to know on which page number, which chapter is there. So also, if you open a ledger book, you will find that it may be primarily created according to the al 
अल्फा मेटल और इनमें भी बाइपोरिकेटेड एक और इनको जियोग्राफी और इनमें भी एक बाइपोरिकेटेड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ द ऑर्डर्स और लोकेशन सो व्हाट एवर द केस में भी इन द लेजर ऑन द स्टार्टिंग इमेज एज यू हैव सीन इन द टेक्स्ट बुक द पेज नंबर्स ऑफ various chapters is given so also in the lecture what we do we have to create one one page for each account now let us take for example here here cash has come first so page number one is allocated for what cash so let us answer to this as debit side this is debit side and this is credit side always remember this so the format will be like this date particulars jf number amount date particulars jf number amount date particulars jf amount date particulars जेएफ जेएफ मीन्स जनरल पोलियो नंबर व्हाट इज द पेज नंबर इन जनरल एलएफ मीन्स लेजर पोलियो नंबर व्हाट इज द पेज नंबर इन लेजर सो आई हैव ओपन वन कैश अकाउंट पेज नंबर 1 पेज नंबर 2 कैपिटल जे पर्टिकुलर्स जेएफ अमाउंट पर्टिकुलर्स जेएफ अमाउंट कैपिटल डी पर्टिकुलर्स जेएफ अमाउंट डी पर्टिकुलर्स so now we will do our ledger posting the transferring of journal entry to ledger is called as what posting ledger posting so here cash account is what debit so this is cash account page number 1 and this is page number 2 capital account so cash account is debited so go and write it on the debit side to capital you will write opposite to capital what you will write to capital how much 50000 ah. now we have to discuss the what cash account cash account how much debit how much Fifty thousand. So on the debit side, I have written what two capital, two capital, and capital account is what credit. So come to the capital account. One more, two more, then buy. You will write here buy. You will write on the debit side two. On the credit side, you will always write what buy. You will write opposite buy cash. How much fifty thousand? So here we come to know that cash account has been debited and capital account has been credited. So let us take one more transaction so that it makes clear to you. Purchase goods of rupees twenty thousand. Let us take one example. Purchase goods of rupees twenty thousand. So here. Four four two thousand ten. Purchase account debit two cash account. So now whether purchase account has already appeared? No, there are already two accounts. One is cash, another is what capital. So purchase account is new. Have I created new page? Page number three. How much? Twenty thousand. 
Bank account, order me it is existing or no? Yes, it is existing. Page number one is allocated to our part. Yes. So page number one. Twenty thousand. We use purchase. We use purchase. So now we are supposed to open one more account called as purchase account. So we are supposed to open what now? Purchase account. So page number three is what? Purchase account. Date, particulars, year, now. Date. Now see here, purchase account has been debited. So four four two thousand ten. You will write the amount to cash. How much? Twenty thousand. Jaman to your amounts. This is the page number. Maybe this is the first page. So you can write here one one. And one. So now, on the credit side, cash, cash is there. So come on, the credit side is the cash account. Four, four, two thousand ten. You will write opposite of that. Why purchase? Why purchase? How much? Now, 
let us say two more examples and so here i will not prepare a lecture in the proper format because space is short i will just do it like this so this is the right side and this is the right side in the t form i will show now the different right side later on uh, when we are actually doing that so we will write all those common that is date particulars j and about date particular j and about as i have done in the previous case now due to the shortage of space i will just take it to like this only to write on the like this or double like this you will see date particulars and then debit and then one four two thousand fifteen the next one will cost will be sixty thousand so cash account debit to capital account so please look out for me the market rate for cash to use capital sixty thousand sixty thousand We will commence the business. We will business commence. Or started. Now, page number one. Cash account. Page number two. Capital. So one four two two one fifteen. Cash account in what? Debited to capital. You write the opposite to capital. How much it is? Sixty thousand. Other debit. Capital account is credited. So right on the credit side, one four two thousand fifteen by cash. How much? Sixty thousand. So let us see the next time answer. Ten four two thousand fifteen. Purchase goods of rupees thirty thousand of rupees. Vijay, purchase goods of rupees thirty thousand from Vijay. So what will be the channel entry? Purchase account debit to Vijay account. Purchase account debit to Vijay account. Now see the result. Whether we are in purchase account, no. So we account should be open, and we don't have even one which account. We have to put our account on for page two which account. So now here. Purchase account. Page number three. Visa account. Page number four. Purchase account. Debit side. 